Hi everyone, I'm Fiona and I'm an SEO exec at Tug. And so I'm going to be talking to you today very briefly about canonical tags. I'm going to keep this really nice and practical because I think this is an issue that uh, a lot of sites do have. Um, so hopefully it might help you to, to solve some of your challenges. Uh, so very briefly, a canonical tag is a way of telling Google or other search engines which is the master version of a page. So if you've got a page with a couple of pages with, with similar content on, what you can do is add a canonical tag that says that page A is the, the master version, and the, the version that should be indexed and showing up in your uh, search results rather than uh, version B or version C. Uh, so let's dive into a quick example. Um, so the one that I want to talk through today is, um, so we've got a, a very inspired um, company.com uh, website here with a hats page. Um, so what we want to happen is that this nice clean URL uh, and all of the lovely content on the hats page to be what is showing up, being indexed and showing up in the search results. Um, what we don't want to see is something like this appearing. Um, if you do any form of paid advertising, you'll probably recognize the, um, the G cleared in that first, in that second URL. Um, or if you um, have an e-commerce site or have done any online shopping, you'll probably recognize the latter one, which is if you've got a product page and you've been filtering it on, on sizes or colors. Um, you should know at this point that this could be an e-commerce example, but this stretches well beyond e-commerce sites and it's applicable to, to all websites. So as I say, what we want is not these two URLs in orange to be showing up. We want this nice, clean company.com for such hats to be showing up in our search results. We want that to be what is in our search console, in our analytics and so forth, rather than anything else. Uh, and, and the way we solve this is, is quite straightforward. So what we're going to do is apply a self-referential canonical tag to the hats page. Um, and the way that we do this is um, as you can, in the head of the page, we um, will add in link, rel equals canonical. Um, and then it's the crucial bit. In the href here, we've got company.com forward slash hats um, as the master version of the page. So what's in the href is, is the master version. And what happened now is that any iteration of, of that URL um, will basically uh, revert the this company.com for such hats is the master version. Anything else is sort of auxiliary to that. Um, and that's all you need to do, really. Um, hopefully, um, I mean, I know this has been a bit of a whistle stop tour through, but uh, hopefully it's been useful. Um, if you do have any questions, please let me know, or equally another member of the Tug SEO team who will be very happy to help you. Thank you very much.